Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Fearless Floyd Show. As always, I am your host, Fearless Floyd, and today is December 30th, 2022, Friday, and you're watching this video because you believe you're watching the video that I originally did on Chris Hauser way back when, um, and it got taken down by YouTube, so you're watching the replacement video. So if you want to watch the original video, you have to go to Rumble. That link will be uh, in the description below. Or you can just go over to Rumble, boom, click on the Chris Hauser series, and you can watch all of them. Uh, but here, let me show you uh, what happened. There we go. YouTube removed your content. Hi, Fearless Floyd Show. We wanted to let you know our team reviewed your content. And we think it violates our harassment policy. We know you may not have realized this was a violation of our policies, so we're not applying a strike to your channel. However, we have removed the following content from YouTube. Who is Christopher Hauser? Seven part expose, part one of seven. We realize this may be disappointing news, but it's our job to make sure that YouTube is a safe place for all. If you think we've made a mistake, you can appeal this decision. You'll find more details below. What our policy says, content that shares, threatens to share, encourage others to share non-public, personal, personally identifiable information isn't allowed on YouTube. This includes but it's not limited to an individual's home address, email address, sign-in credentials, phone numbers, passport number, medical records, bank account information, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Learn more here. What I can do next. Uh, we want to help you keep your content on YouTube. So please review your YouTube's community guidelines. Double check how your content may have violated our guidelines. Appeal here if you think we've made a mistake. If you have any further questions, please feel free to reach us out here. Sincerely, the YouTube team. Well, <clears throat> YouTube, Google, Chrome running on the Adreno system. Right. Uh, appreciate you guys, uh, you know, taking it down. I ain't tripping. So if you really want to know about Chris Hauser, go watch those series. So let me give you a quick update on the Chris Hauser status while I have your attention here. So I can give you this update on what's going on with Mr. Christopher. Uh, Mr. Crickets, I call him, because, uh, you know, he doesn't defend himself very well. Of course, when you call him out. Uh, playing this game again. We'll find window. Here we go. All right. And, boom, I'll reload this. Just so you all can see, it's a fresh page. This was the uh, last event that happened in the state of Tennessee versus <clears throat> all these morons and Chris Hauser. And this was the last entry in this case. And they had the hearing on April 6th, 2022. And this was in the Tennessee Supreme Court. And that was the next filing. Boom, boom. They, they checked out the appellate record on the 11th. And that's when the uh, justices of the Tennessee Supreme Court's clerks got busy. And they've been busy ever since. So how long have they been busy on Chris's court case? They've been busy for a hot minute. How long is a hot minute, Floyd? A hot minute is whoops, wrong one. I told you, kids, I keep up with this shit. Uh, I don't play around. Ain't nobody playing. 
it has been 268 days since uh, they heard arguments before the Tennessee Supreme Court. So there's about 100 days left, roughly, about 97, before we have a full year. We'll be back to April 10th. Now, in my own experience, when it takes a appellate court, whether it's a criminal appellate court or a superior appellate court, 268 days is quite a long time to deliver an opinion. Quite a long time. And they're pushing on that year. So it's uh, going to be uh, very interesting. Uh, I would think that if it's taking this much time to write a opinion, that uh, th th they're, they're going to make a statement with this. Watch. I'm telling you guys. Listen to me. I know what I'm talking about. I've read enough opinions. When they take this much time, it's... Yeah, you know, it's not cut and dried. They want to make a point. They want to make a statement. And that's what they're doing. So, uh, you know, of course, he's got his whole private bank thing, whatever. Uh, you know, y'all y'all more than welcome to do whatever y'all want to do with him. I, I really don't care anymore. Uh, you know, he, nobody should be listening to a word he says, period, in the story. Uh, I, I think he's, you know, I don't know. Just watch the videos. Like, subscribe, share, hit the notification bell, leave a comment below. Fierce Floyd Show at yahoo.com. If you want to email me, I'm on Telegram. I'm on all these different things over here. I got the trust classes rolling, the VCR classes. I got trust 201 and 101. We just did 201. And man, I tell you what, uh, I, I don't think there was a, I don't think nobody asked more than five or six questions after the presentations. Uh, it was pretty awesome. They uh, They really got it. And uh, we are moving forward. We are going to create our trusts and we are going to fund our trusts and we're going to start operating privately. You're going to be going, wow, what the hell are they doing over there? Just telling y'all kids. All right, man, thanks for being here. I uh, just want to put that in the air as a replacement for how come I'm not seeing the original Chris Hauser video. Go on Rumble to see it. It'll be in the description below. Thank you for watching the video. Appreciate you. I will see you guys next video or next year. Have a safe and happy new year. May all your dreams and wishes come true. And for those out there waiting on this RV, God bless us. It's our time. Make it happen.